Hello everyone, starting off this Easter egg from the starting area at the club entrance, you're going to progress over to the biker's garage on the north side of the map. And you can do this in a couple different ways, but if you don't want to put on a disguise, all you have to do is from the starting area, go over to the right, and then we'll take a left, and then another right, and then a left again. One more right, and now we're at this bridge, and then we will subdue this person once they get close enough. We're going to drag them so they're hidden. Leave the body there, we don't need to dump it. And we'll crouch down right here, wait for this guy to turn around, and we can keep moving. And then you're going to progress over to this trench right here, and then you can climb down, and then sneak across right here by jumping to the ledge. And then you're going to scale back up, take a right, sneak by this guy, keep on moving through. And then you're going to take another right, and then a left. And now you got two guards, we can still avoid these guys. We're just going to sneak into the bushes right here, and then go all the way up to this wall, and then you can scale this pipe right here. And we're going to go all the way up. And then at the top, you're going to hang on this metal bar, you're going to move over to the right, and then you're going to vault all the way to the top of the building. We're just about to where we need to get the first piece for this Easter egg. We're going to go down these stairs, and then take a left, open this door, and there's going to be some people in here. We can avoid them, we're going to stay crouched. Then we'll go down the stairs, take a left, go down the stairs again, and there's going to be one guy down here. We're just going to go through this door to to the left then turn left once again and then you're going to turn right and as soon as you turn right on this table there's going to be a crowbar you're going to pick that up and then you're going to go back the way you came then you're going to turn right through this door and then we're going to subdue this guy and then this box right underneath the stairs this is where our first piece is going to be that we need for this easter egg and it's a gold idol we're going to pick that up now that we have the gold idol, we can leave this building so what we're going to do is go back the way we came go out this door go up the stairs and then we'll just avoid these guys, go through this door, go up the stairs again, and then we'll vault back over this ledge, move to the left, and then climb back down this pipe. And you can slide all the way down, make it a little bit faster. And then we'll crouch through the bushes to avoid these guys, and then move all the way down this. Take a right here, take a left across the bridge, and if one of the agents is in your way, you can just wait for a little bit, wait for him to turn around and leave that spot. He's slightly turned away, we can walk behind him at this point. Then take a left, and once again, we can climb down and then do that little jump, jump to ledge movement, and we'll vault back up. Then we'll go back to the same bridge that we originally came over, take a right, take a left, and then we're going to keep going straight here. It's going to be kind of a swampy area with a bunch of crates. And then you're going to see this chair. Looks a little odd, right? And it looks like there's a gold idol symbol on the chair. So you walk up to the chair, and now you're going to pull out the gold idol, and then you're going to use the item placement button, and then place the gold idol on the chair. And you're just going to leave it there for a moment. See that little flash? That's going to trigger the Easter egg, and now you can sit down in this chair. Now this pond is glowing. You're just going to wait a moment, and... The Easter egg is going to trigger. Don't trust. Don't trust anyone. When the wine is poured, the blood will flow. Don't dance the dance of death. Don't trust anyone. You are on your own. You always were, and you always will be. Over here. How is the head? How is your mind? Has it kicked in? Don't you have fresh meat to take care of? Eliminate them. Their blood is warm, but they have no soul. Like you and your kind. Murderer. <laughs> Rough day. You should try and be in my shoes. You should try being an agent for Interzone. That is a real job. All they give you is bug powder, something one must not decline. Have you ever tasted bug powder? It's very, very good. And you should. Now, that is all I have to say for now, Agent 47. Maybe I will see you again in Interzone. <laughs> And that's the end of that Easter egg. Pretty unique, right? That's all there is to it. So if you have any questions at all, please post them in the comment section. Leave a like if you found this to be helpful or enjoyable. Subscribe for more. Thank you for watching and I'll see you all in the next one.